Hi everyone, last week I talked about biscuits and I promised you I'd show you how I make my favourite homemade biscuits. These are chocolate hazelnut bites. So these are much lower in sugar than regular biscuits and they also have the added bonus of having lots of really nutritious ingredients and they're also really easy to make. So I have about 100 grams of oats and 100 grams of ground almonds. That's just about a cup full of each of those. Um, I have about 50 grams of chopped hazelnuts, which is about a good handful, and then two ripe bananas that I'm just gonna mash and they'll um, hold the biscuits together. And then I'm using about 25 grams of sugar. So this is just some brown sugar that I had in the press. You could use brown or white or even honey or something like that. Um, so this batch makes about 15 biscuits. And so even when you include this sugar and the little bit of sugar that's in the dark chocolate that I'm going to use as a topping, it works out at about half a teaspoon of sugar per biscuit. Now if you remember in last week's video, the plain old boring digestive had slightly more sugar than that and the, the chocolate cookie had about four times that amount of sugar. So this is a much better option and really nutritious like I said as well. Um, and then, like I mentioned, I'm just going to put some dark chocolate um, on top of about 50 grams there and um, some more chopped hazelnuts just to sprinkle on top as well. So all you do is add the oats, ground almonds, hazelnut sugar and mashed bananas to a bowl and mix it well. Then using a teaspoon and your hands, roll up about 15 balls and spread them out on a baking tray on some greaseproof paper. Then use a fork to flatten them out a little bit, then just pop them into a preheated oven at 180 degrees for about 12 or 15 minutes until they turn golden. Then let them cool and add your topping of some chocolate and more hazelnuts. So I usually store these in the fridge in a container just to keep the chocolate nice and crisp. So why not give them a go? Don't eat them all at once, but do enjoy. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next week. Oh, so my upper body strength has improved since the last test.